Everybody knows what the heart looks like. It's kind of heart-shaped, the clues in the name. But what about the heart sounds? When you listen to somebody's chest, you're going to hear the pulse there, the heart beating, lub-dub, lub-dub, lub-dub. But what's actually making that noise? It's actually not the heart squeezing together, but actually the sound of the valves within the heart closing. So there are four valves in the heart. We've got the tricuspid, the pulmonary, the mitral, and just at the back there, the aortic valve. And the first heart sound, S1, the lub, is made by the tricuspid and the mitral valve closing. So it stands to reason that the second heart sound, the dub or S2, is caused by the pulmonary and aortic valve closing. And thus, that's one of the reasons why we listen to the heart. Because if there are problems with these valves, such as aortic stenosis, we're going to get a change to the lub-dub sound that we'll get, and that sound can tell us what's going on with those different valves. We know that the sounds of the heart, the lub-dub, are caused by the valves within the heart closing. And there are things that can happen that can accentuate those sounds and some things that you can actually try yourself. Given that we know the lub noise is caused by the mitral valve and the tricuspid valve closing, if you increase your heart rate, so for example, running up and down, and then listen to your heart, you're certainly going to hear that lub sound increased in volume or accentuated. Why? Because as the heart beats faster, we get a shorter diastole, a shorter filling time, because we're trying to push as much blood as we can. That shortened diastole means that the valve is going to close with much greater force and thus we're going to hear a larger S1 sound. Now if we go to a pathology, mitral stenosis for example, again we're going to hear that accentuated valve sound. Why? Because now we've got something that's causing a narrowing or stiffening the valve, so forcing the valve open is harder and closing it back again is going to cause a louder sound in a very similar way to that which happened when you go running. It's all about what is caused that heart sound, that lub in this particular case with, say, the mitral valve, what's caused that sound to be accentuated. And this is the core of auscultating the heart and listening to heart sounds, thinking why has that heart sound changed and what will cause that heart sound to work out the pathology underneath it. Take care and I'll see you in the next one. Cheerio.